Hi, this is Mike, and uh, this tutorial is going to show you how to access um, the assignments that your students have posted once you've created your assignment um, and they've submitted the assignments. So, first thing you want to do is uh, go to your Blackboard site, and in your control panel, um, you'll see your Grade Center down here at the bottom left. And I'll click on Grade Center, and I'll click on Full Grade Center. <coughs> and you should see a list of all the students enrolled in the class and if you um, I'm going to take a look at the last assignment that I created so I'm going to scroll over and take a look at that new assignment I called it and I see that this particular student um, has submitted their paper and it needs grading and I denote that by that uh, green box with the exclamation point in it and if I hover over the uh, right hand side of that box I can click to see options and I can view grade details. Okay, so now I see that I can go in Actually, that one was a bad example because I didn't. There was no uh, paper attached to that one, so I jumped over to another uh, one, assignment paper number one instead where there is a paper. And so you'll notice here there's view attempt, clear attempt, edit grade, and allow additional attempt if you wanted to allow the student to submit something else. Um, but I'm going to click on view attempt and I can see the assignment information here. Um, or I can review the current attempt and here's what the student wrote, here's my paper and here's their attached file and I can download that just by clicking on it and I can actually, um, I've got my computer set up to open it up with Microsoft Word because it's a Word document and I can go in, I can grade it, I can add my comments For example, I can just put a comment up here. Um, and I'll save that paper. Okay, so once I've graded the paper, I can then uh, go into my grade current attempt. And this is out of 50 points. And I'll give this student a 45. And I can write feedback here if I like. And I can also submit that paper that I put the corrections on. I can browse my computer and I can locate the file that I want. And I can put my grading notes if I like this stuff the student won't see and I can attach files and the student won't see that as well. And I can go ahead and either save and go to the next paper or save and exit. And I'll save and exit. And that's it. Now I've got a record of everything that I've done with that paper. If I click on View Attempt again, I'll now see the student paper in section number two. And my grade, along with my feedback, as well as the paper that I've submitted in response. And that's it. If I go back to my Grade Center, I'll see the... Uh, grade that I gave the student for that paper and there it is.